Most people haven't figured out yet that while the new tax cuts mean you will pay less tax from next year, it also means that your tax deductions are going to be worth less as soon as these tax cuts kick in. For example, if your income is $190,000 this year, this year your tax deductions are gonna be refunded at 47 cents in the dollar or 47%, but as soon as one July rolls around, they're only gonna be refunded at 37%. That's 10% less back and for your buck and it's gonna make a big difference to your tax return. And this doesn't just apply to high income earners. If your income's 20 grand, then tax deductions this year are gonna be worth 19%. Next year, they're only gonna be worth 16%. If your income's 50K, then this year your tax deductions are worth 32%. Next year, they're only gonna be worth 30%. And if you're on an income of 130K, your tax deductions this year are gonna be worth 37%, but next year, they're only gonna be worth 30%. Now the average tax refund in Australia is $2,800. So if you're able to get 10% more back, that means an extra $280 in your pocket on average across Australia. And there's a lot of potential for that to be more if your income's higher or you've got higher levels of tax deductions. If you own an investment property, you're probably claiming tens of thousands of dollars of tax deductions each year, particularly with high interest rates at the moment. So you're talking about a massive difference in how much you're gonna get refunded this year versus next. So what this all means is if you wanna use the rules to your maximum advantage, you've got a small window of opportunity to get as many deductions as you can in this current financial year where they're going to be worth more to you. Prepaying tax deductible expenses will be a winning strategy in this current financial year and mean that you get more money back from the expenses that you're going to pay and they cost you less after tax. Having your tax deductible expenses fall into this current financial year has two benefits. Firstly, as mentioned, the deductions are going to be worth more to you, so you're going to get more back after tax. Secondly, you're going to be getting the money back in your bank account a full year sooner than what it otherwise would be. Most people don't think too much about their tax planning until after the financial year is finished, but if you wait until after the financial year, your ability to really change anything meaningful is going to be limited or non-existent. Being on the front foot with your tax planning is something that's important and valuable in every financial year, but given that once these tax cuts kick in, deductions are never going to be worth as much as they are right now today, it's even more important to be on top of your tax planning. There's a small window of opportunity here and once it's closed, it will be gone for good, so don't miss out.